another video and today's video is going to be my six month update on this Tanache deep wave hair on my last YouTube video and I got a lot of comments on that video about like how the hair holding up and stuff like that so I just wanted to come back to y'all and tell y'all how it been so if y'all want to see what's up with this Tanache hair stay tuned and before we get into the video I want to give a big shout out to Belongwise company on Instagram. They sent me these contacts that I got in y'all and I really like these contacts. I feel like I look so pretty with these. What y'all think? I don't care if y'all think I look ugly. I like them. But if you want to look at some of these contacts, sis, I'm going to have their um, website and their Instagram linked in the description box. So y'all can go get y'all some of these bomb ass contacts. They not irritable. They not itchy or nothing. Like I feel like nothing is in my eyes at all. So if you want to get some of these contacts, sis, I'm going to have a link down below so you can go shop with them and tell them I sent you, period. Alright, so boom. Um, first thing I have to say about this hair is that it's bomb. Like, it's really bomb. There's nothing bad to say about it. Like, it's still the same length that it was. And this is, I believe, 22 inches. I'm not, I think, yeah, I think it was 22 inches. And I had, um trimmed it a little bit so that's why it's like a little blunt looking and it's like shorter but yeah i like this hair it's thick like it don't it's not hard to manage like you know how some curly hair just be so bushy and nappy when they get wet like this hair no it's not hard to manage i can really put my fingers through it and it don't get stuck like it don't really shed like that when i first made the wig it shed it a little bit but all wigs and all hair do that when you first make a wig, especially if you cut your wefts. And I always cut my wefts so my wigs can lay flatter. So when I first installed the wig, it was shedding a little bit. But like after I wore it for a while, like it stopped shedding for real. Like it only get a couple hairs every now and then when I brush it. Um, it's so freaking soft, y'all. Like it's so soft. Like when it dry, it get a little bushier than this. But if you wanted to stay like with that wet look, I already did a video about how to do that. I'm going to put it in the cards right now. But basically, you just want to wet it with a spray bottle and put like leave-in conditioner in it and some mousse. And then you can be good, sis. Period. What else? I'm trying to think of stuff to say about this hair. But it's really nothing bad to say. So. And the closure, as y'all can see, the closure still looking nice. It's not balding. Like the part didn't get too wide or nothing. Um, I'm, I'm really trying to sit here and really like think because I want this to be like at least a 10 minute video so y'all can like know what's up with this hair but it's really nothing bad to say about this hair y'all like go get you some of this Tanache hair because it's bomb and this girl commented um on my last video about this hair and with one of my supporters and she was asking like should she order it from the Tanache website or should she go on AliExpress I got mine off the Tanache website um, when I was trying to order it on AliExpress, they kept asking for like all this extra information and I didn't, it wasn't working for me. So I just went on their website. Now on their website, it is higher. On AliExpress, it's cheaper. Like the lens that I got, it would have been like 130 something on, on AliExpress. But when I got on, when I went on their website, it was like 170 something. So that's the only difference I can think of about the um the difference between the hair and my friend ordered some tanache hair off the aliexpress because it worked for her for some reason it wouldn't work for me and her hair was the same like it was soft she got the straight she got the Brazilian straight um i'm gonna link her review in the description below if you thinking about getting some of that straight hair but she got the straight um brazilian and she got a closure as well and that hair was long and silky and soft and i actually made the wig for her so I know like it's really no difference between the quality of the hair from their main website and AliExpress. So to answer your question, it's really no difference besides the price. The price on their website is higher. But other than that, you gonna get the same quality hair. Like when I bleached the knots, they bleached it, they bleached very easily. It didn't take a long time to lift or nothing like that. Um I haven't been wearing this hair for six months straight. Like, I haven't. I've been switching my hair. But, like, I always come back to this hair. This is my go-to wig. Like, I went to an interview today, and I wore this wig. Like, anytime I got to go to a job interview or 
anything like that. I just throw this wig on, spray some water, put some mousse in it, and it's I'm out the door. Like it's so easy to manage. Um, it's like if you get a closure, it's so like if you get a closure and you make a closure wig, like when you just put the wig on and just spray it, it's like so easy. Like you don't have to sit there and style it every single day. That's one thing I like about this curly hair. Like even if you like at nighttime when you really lay down, like you just wet it, put some mousse in it, some leave in conditioner when you wake up and put it on, you'll be out the door. Like you don't have to do too much to this hair to make it look, you know, silky or make it look good. Uh, it's really like you can really this hair you don't have to put no effort into it like at all and I had this wig sitting inside my bag of wigs for like a month and I haven't touched it and when I took it out it wasn't matted it wasn't nappy or nothing so now I'm gonna turn around and let y'all see how it look in the back and y'all I'm tall I'm tall, I'm 5'7", and y'all see, like, it come to, like, middle of my back for real. And I only got 22 inches, so if you do get this curly hair, if you my height, 22 inches, if you want to go for this look, 22 inches would be good for you. Like, you don't have to get, you know, nothing longer than that. But if you want the longer, like, look, I suggest you to get, you shouldn't have to get, like, 28. You should probably be able to get 26 24 inches and it's gonna be long on you because this hair was actually long to be 22 inches Don't forget y'all I did trim it. So it was longer than this So just keep that in mind when you are ordering your hair. I really love to not shake hair like I refer people to them um, That's why I refer my friend to them. I refer my friend mother to them like they really got some good affordable hair y'all so if y'all looking for some high quality low maintenance soft thick bomb ass brazilian deep wave or any type of virgin hair go shop with tinashe hair because you're not going to regret it sis i promise you take my word for it y'all know i don't lie to y'all about nothing so y'all that was my six month update on this tinashe hair y'all i really love this hair so much y'all need to go shop with them i'm gonna have their store in their ad express store link down below so y'all can go shop with them and tell them I sent y'all. Pretty cool. All right, bye, Lane Nation. Thanks for watching. I love you.